all right guys welcome to my channel we want to solve this math problem on the board okay now whenever you have addition of two logarithms all you need to do is to multiply the terms of those logarithms so we're going to be having log x minus 2 times x plus 2 okay equals now the base here is a natural base okay the question is in base theory base theory so here is base theory now, because we have a base theory here and we have equal to 2, you are going to say 3 raised to the power of 2. The base, we have to take the number here as its indices. Okay. So, what do we do next? We are going to be having, let's equate this guy to this right hand side. So, you have x minus 2, x plus 2 equals 8. No, 9. 3 raised to the power of 2 is 9. So once you have used your base here to get the number at the right hand side, equate the terms of that logarithm to that number here. Okay, and that's all. So we have a quadratic equation. The first thing we do is to expand the brackets completely. So x times x will give us x squared. x times 2 will give us 2x, right? Minus 2 times x is minus 2x. Minus 2 times 1, minus 2 times 2 is minus 4, equals 9. Now 2x can subtract 2x, so both of them are gone. We have x squared minus 4 equals 9. So let's collect like terms. That means we have x squared equal to 9 plus 4. That means um, 4 crosses over to become plus 4. So we have x squared equals 13. So to, to eliminate the square, eliminate the square, take the square root of the both sides. So that means we will have x will be equal to plus or minus square root of 13. So when you take square root here, the power goes. You now have only x. Now, because we are solving quadratic equation, if you take the square root, you, plus, you put plus and minus. So our x will either be a positive root 13 or a negative root 13 that becomes the solution thanks a lot for watching please do well to like this video and share it to your friends follow for more interesting math tutorial bye